This little exercise is for a workshop I'm doing on brush sketching at the 2017 Urban Sketchers Symposium in Chicago. The concept is very simple. We're just going to be doing very quick five minute sketches of simple objects, isolated objects on the street. It could be anything. A person, a car, maybe like this little motorbike. The idea is five minute drawings directly with a brush. No pencil, no planning, just dive right in. What I'm looking for in this thing called a broken silhouette is for an accumulation of brush strokes to draw the object just by placing color next to color till you've gradually filled the entire shape. We're training a number of things at the same time. Dexterity with the brush, the ability to spot a color and place it down on the page, and the ability to simplify something into the minimum number of strokes. You know, and the best way to practice this is just to do a lot of it. So we'll do sets of these say a burst of five sketches in 20 minutes. So that's the first exercise. Now, the second thing is to flip the process and draw the object directly with the brush by drawing around with a background color. So essentially you're making a negative shape cut out of the object and then come back into that white shape that you've drawn and fill in the shadow side of the object. So you've drawn it with the background and then the mass tone, reserving the whites. Now, if you have a high key object like this lion, this is a perfect example of this, where by drawing one edge with the background color and the other edge with the shadow color, it comes together to build the object with just two little washes. So a couple things to note are how, uh, if your background is trees or clouds, uh, of course it doesn't have to be a flat tone. You can suggest things with the gaps that you leave. And uh, as you're building the solid form of the object, I like to emphasize color variation as much as possible. So I'm placing pure color next to color and you get some happy accidents. Things just merge together into shapes. So I think you can see, if you can draw the silhouette of any one object, you can combine them together to make a complete painting. Every situation, no matter how complicated, is just a series of interlocking silhouettes fit together like a puzzle or strung in a line or isolated into a graphic object. Okay, that's it for now. So we'll see you in Chicago, or maybe you'll be trying this at home. Either way, have fun. Talk to you soon.